Oni of Ife was said to be in shock over what the diviner from the Brazil said concerning his wife and the, the palace. We do know that uh, they said allegedly, because I wasn't there, they said the king, when the prophecy about his throne and the dreams became too much, he sent his uh, private jet to go to Brazil to pick that uh, diviner that told him that he would be a king many years ago before he became king. And other diviners, they said there are other trust, uh, diviners that are trustworthy from that Brazil that uh, came together with the main one that he sent for. And when these people came, they said ever since over four or five days that they were in the palace, there have been prophecies upon prophecies upon prophecies. And each one they want to give, they will make sure that the elders are gathered, you know. And one of the prophecies that these people have given is that Queen Naomi and the Union of Fife are inseparable because they are 14th century reincarnated lovers you know they explained it i've made the video here you can go and check it under my videos then they also said that uh, the reason why runke was planted into the palace and all of that of which that is very obvious to the whole people especially those of them who are involved then another thing that they said the these people said that was so shocking is that they said only of Ife is away what will befall him if Queen Naomi eventually disconnects from him. And some of these elders also know about it. That the reason why they are fighting Queen Naomi's return is because they don't wish the king well. They, they want him, uh, they want Queen, Queen Naomi to be away from him so that something bad will hit him. Then, another uh, prophecy, because there have been several prophecies, they also said that the gods are not happy with uh, the king due to uh, Prince Tade Nikawo. That they are not happy the way Prince Tade Nikawo was given to him for a reason. He is still outside the palace. Why strangers are in his palace? Then the main person that is supposed to be in the palace is outside the palace. So with all of these prophecies, they say prophecy has been going on and on and on and on. They say why these people are giving their prophecies everywhere was quiet, very, very quiet. You know, even though some of these elders, they know what these people are saying is the truth, you know. Then they said after the first person finished uh, his own prophecy, then the next diviner that came with them started his own. And to only of the first greatest surprise, they said that one made it clear to him that you see all of these wives that they are going to leave you. That and last time we heard that uh, Oni opened up on why he is not fast in sending the women out of his palace. That a lot of people have labeled him a king that cannot keep a woman, you know, and that is beginning to look as if it is true, considering how many women that have left him. So if he is in a hurry to send all of these wives outside the palace and when Naomi re uh, refused to return back to him. It simply confirms that what people are saying is the truth. So that said, that is why he is having double mind. Uh, uh, why he's not too quick in action to send them outside. And the couple with the fact they said the diviner made it clear before now that he should be very kind. To he should be kind to all of them, treat them well, and all of that. So, but this particular diviner. That started his own prophecy today made it clear that whether only treat them well or not whether he send them outside or not that they are going to live in due time that all of them except for Queen Naomi that this journey of royalty that he can only go on the journey with Queen Naomi okay the other uh, uh, diviner also made it clear that the journey of this royalty uh, that it is uh, his destiny to work with Queen Naomi, that if he decides to work alone without Queen Naomi, that whatever he see, he takes, and the consequences might be too bad, you know, which also includes detriment and all of that. And we do know that there are several people working against Oni of Ife, especially those from other ruling families, 
who really don't want him to be the king, especially the family of Rung get them from what we have been hearing. Yes, so so now the diviner is making it clear to him that whether you send them out or not, that in due time, what will push them out of your life will still push them out of your life. That all of these experiences of not staying with women is because you have not met with the right person. They have given you the right person and you don't want to cherish it. And you allow the, the right person to leave. That means whether you like it or not, they are also going to leave. That the best thing for you to do is to go and bring your wife, Queen Naomi, back to the palace. That it is your destiny that she must be with you for you to succeed. Yeah, my people. See, everyone is pointing at the same direction. And the earlier the king do something, the better for him. A lot of prophecies have been coming. Some other prophecies said that only of Ife is giving some people money to support him because he doesn't listen to the gods. He is doing, he is thinking about what people will say. And it's because he is thinking about what people will say that made him to keep all of these women in the palace. Because he's, he's thinking that they will still call him someone that cannot keep a wife and all of that. That the gods have destined what he will be. What people will think or say shouldn't be his problem. After all, now that he did not send them, people are talking. If he send them, people will still be talking. So the best thing for him to do is to listen to the gods and do as the gods who uh, place him there want him to do. That is because he is listening to people. That is why he is taking orders from people. That he is supposed to be the one giving orders, saying this thing must go like this and it will go like that. That is the criteria, number one criteria that made him a king. But he is there listening to some of these elders whom they, he know that they are in his life to, to ensure that uh, there is no progress and all of that. And he is listening to some of them. Okay, sometimes they give them money so that they will kind of stand with him. Whereas he has the power over them. Because as a king, as the uh, 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 first son of the gods, they said the king have much power, more than he thought he has, you know. But because, because he is listening to people, because a lot of people are telling him what to do and, and, and what not to do, it looks as if the gods have turned their back on him. Anyways, when I hear this, I say, now, wow, these people also, they believe in prophecy so much. But it's, it's like the problem here is uh, when they give you the prophecy, walk towards it. Mm -hmm. Anyway, guys, when I hear this, I say, now, wow, no be smart. And I want to remind you that these are all alleged information, okay? Always bear that in mind. Thanks for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're yet to subscribe. And share my video. Love you guys. Bye for now.